Mesa TV presents in 3, 2, 1. Dateline Schools with your host, Carrie Harrington. All this week on Dateline Schools, we're learning about some of the many activities coming up for the Know How to Go initiative here in St. Clair County for the 2015-16 school year. Had the opportunity to, to learn all about it as we talk with the new higher education consultant here at St. Clair County, Risa. Megan Nesty. And, and Megan, I know last week you had your first event of the year. It's hard to believe we're already getting things kicked off here. And that was the, the new College Application Toolkit, which you alluded to a little bit yesterday. Tell us all about that. Yes, absolutely. The College Application Toolkit is really something for you know students to really learn about that college application process, which can be overwhelming and daunting for sure for a lot of students. But this is a really a way for them to kind of understand what do I need, pay attention to deadlines, you know, what schools require an essay, you know, um, so it, it kind of helps them organize all of that information uh, that they're just bombarded with <laughs> through the mail and email. So uh, it's a really great way to kind of navigate that process. But you said you made some changes this year. What, what's, what's different about this year's toolkit than what we've had in the past? Yes, uh, this year's toolkit, uh, previous years students have had a whole crate full of folders and things. What we've done is really kind of compacted that into one little kind of pendaflex, if you will, uh, one folder that they can really kind of carry around. It's a little bit uh, more mobile friendly, if you will. So uh, that's definitely been one of the biggest changes, I think. Right. I know you had the, the first event out at KPAC High School last week. You got several of these um, toolkit uh, workshops coming up, don't you? Yes, yes, we do. We schedule these at each individual high school in the county. Uh, and then we also host some here at RISA as well to kind of help students. Um, if they can't make it to one of the schools, they can come to ours. Where can people get information about when and where some of these activities are being held? Yeah, all of this information is available on our website, which is sckh, the number two, go.org. Uh, and all of the dates are on there. Students can sign up for those events. They can learn more about those events as well. So they can go just onto our website and check that out. We'll be back with more tomorrow. For Dateline Schools, I'm Terry Harrington.